to uh, make an announcement. I've been having a problem with line of sight. Back in Antarctica, I live in a place called the Keep of Eternal Hatred. I have an eyeball that I live inside the weeping and mouthed eye of eternal horror. With this eyeball, I am capable of looking into everybody's bathroom and seeing them in their naughty underwear. I see you flicking your labias. I see you licking your cunts. I see you shitting out your dick slits. I see, but there is things that are stopping me from seeing what I want to see. Buildings, buildings, buildings are in the way making me not see pussies getting fingered. So, it all boils down to this. From now on, all buildings over three stories tall will be torn down. All buildings under three stories tall will be flogged daily. Get it done. I will now answer questions with my friend P.K. Take the mic. Well, I'm thinking about having a little party. Maybe a buffet, some cake. For our 25th anniversary, of course, we're touring relentlessly. Press out the ass, interviews out the dick slit, booze out the cup. We are also promoting our new album, Lust in Space. 25 years of guard is too good for you fucking people. So you're gonna get 26. It will stay! Quars! 25th anniversary for two years! Then! After two years of it being the 25th anniversary, then we shall go straight to 50! And it will remain 50! Until we fucking say something different, which could be at any moment. Thank you. Next question. The H1N1 flu virus, is that a conspiracy to kill the population? It's bullshit! Herpes is a lot worse! So what, you got some dead babies? <laughs> 21 children died last week. Who gives a shit? 80,000 children died in Africa last week of starvation. 400 Taliban babies we're born without a crack addiction. These are the true problems of the world. And the Somali pirates are freedom fighters. You know, millions of babies in America are born without health care every day. So be Canadian. Before the UN moved into Somali waters, they better be ready to grant the Somalis the rights that have guaranteed them under UN charter. There is a 10 mile international exclusion zone. You are not allowed to go there and dump your fucking garbage. You motherfucking Italians with your fucking cruise liners, you're not allowed to drive into Somali waters and dump your fucking shit containers into the fucking water that you move into with your giant machines and take all the fish. You wanna know why Somalian babies are starving? It's because Italian cruise liners are dumping shit in their water. It's enough to make anyone want to be a pirate. Next question. Now yeah. I want spaghetti. Yeah, explain the, the concept of the last album, Lost in Space. Lost in Space is the story of Guar's escape from Earth, our return to outer space, our discovery that Cardinal Sin has conquered the universe, there is no crap, and our return to Earth to hook up on the cook-up. Next question. You guys celebrate Halloween, and so what did you dress up as? Pac-Man! So, what did you dress up as? Who am I with? Which company? Yeah. She's hot. Nice you remind me of a young Candace Bergen. Mm. Only hot. Very hot. The hotter. <laughs> Next right. question. We got a press conference, isn't it? Wait. Um, biggest problems in society right now, as of today. Oh, uh, the fact that. You people seem to think that Guar are a bunch of costume nincompoops. You continually reward bands like Lordy 
and White Zombie with a bunch of, and Slipknot, and Hollywood Undead, and all these other mass bands that suck my fucking cock, and why the fuck can't Guar have their own goddamn video game? I'm pissed about it, I'm sick of people mouthing off and giving me lip service, talking about how fucking cool Guar is, when it's time to step the fuck up and let Guar play with the big toys. Yeah! What's happening with Sleazy E.P. Martini? He is not on this tour. He did the one tour with us because he promises all of his employees once every 10 years he gets to personally slap the shit out of you if you work for him. That was pretty much why he was on the last tour. He's back at home counting money. Counting money means crap. Crap means me happy. And speaking of which, where is it? All right, let's wrap this up. You have appeared on Red Eye a couple of times. Um, why do human politics interest you so much? Well, I, I refer to it as the ant farm. You humans, we fucked the apes to create you, and now we like to watch your pathetic squibblings and diddlings. And that is why. We need all buildings over three stories tall, ripped down, so we can look at you better. This is all I have to say on the matter. These are my final words. Squad is here now. It is your time to properly worship us in the way that you must. Squad is Squad, and it is our 25th anniversary. So, let's get those lucky contest winners.